Let's move on to the second video here. This is going to be LeBlanc versus Gragas. And this is probably LeBlanc. Yeah, this is about to say. So we'll make fun of him. <laughs> All right. So LeBlanc does a really smart thing of leveling W at level 1. Um, it depends on the matchup what I like to go. But against Gragas especially, I like using the W. Um, I feel like probably could be playing a lot more aggressive with his auto attacks early game. Um, and wait for Gragas to throw out his Q because... Like, Gragas is not just going to take the poke and not Q him. Mm -hmm. He's going to try to Q him, and then you can use the distortion to dodge out his Q and get the trade. Um, so, I like starting either W or Q, depending on if they, my lane opponent has a skill shot or not. Um, but I think probably it's doing, he's doing pretty well, obviously. He should have the advantage over Gragas, but I think he's letting Gragas get too many creeps for free. Okay. Uh, they're, they're even on CS. Gragas is actually ahead in CS, which is like never happened. Okay. Um, and I feel like he could be playing a lot more aggressive with auto attacks and just in general, like waiting for Gragas uh, Q and then using W, because there's no way their jungler is gonna gank like <coughs> pre like three minutes. So he doesn't have to be scared of level one or two. That's one thing I see a lot of people doing is that they're they're often pretty scared at like level two for a gank, but. They they're not really like gonna come until like three ten is a good estimate of when the jungler is gonna try to gank you. Okay. Um, Lamont definitely has the upper hand and probably is doing pretty good with trades. Even though he like, I would like him seeing him play more aggressive. He's still out trading. Greg is pretty hard right now. Mm -hmm. He's playing a lot like I used to play. Um, I used to be really scared of the jungler and just let the other laner push and then try to freeze like he's kind of been doing until now. Um, it's right. actually a really good all in. Yeah, oh, until he miscalculates, <laughs> he 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 forgets that the the barrel slows his attack speed and cancels yeah. an auto attack before he should have. Oh yeah, um, it's still a pretty good all in. Um, I'd say that he could probably have killed Gaius without dying. Um, <laughs> but it's it's still worth it. I'd say I think the wave is gonna push into Gragas tower and he's gonna lose XP. Right. But you definitely want to play really aggressive on Gragas early game, since you really have the upper hand being able to like, dodge his uh, barrels and like possibly even dodging his body slam.